I, oh, yeah, oh, oh, this can't be right. Ah, oh, hey, what are you trying to do to me? Oh, I know, of course. It must be made for you. You're a human. I'm a mechanimal. Go adjust it and get back here fast. Me? You're the genius. You do it. Maybe you didn't pay attention. I can't even touch it! You do it and then bring it back. Now! Hmm. Interesting. Now, why would that happen? Ah, I can figure the medallion to work on a human. Let me think. To modify it. Why, of course. We reverse the energy paths. Make the metal part glass and the glass part metal. Mm -hmm. Now, just a moment. Uh -oh. If you give your medallion to that creature, you won't be able to come back up the pole. You'll be giving up your only way home. Awesome. Yeah, that's true. It, it, it's terrible, but it's true. Uh, we gotta save the machine. That's our first priority. I'm afraid I agree with Bud. It's the good of the many versus the good of the few. And in this case, the many is the entire human race, while the few is... Well... <laughs> it's you. I mean, uh, we're sorry. Uh, listen, we'll figure a way to get you out. Uh, shouldn't take more than uh, four months. Six tops. Now remember, make a new glass part and a new metal part. I only hope there's a way to do that down there. Don't talk to me! Leave me alone! I mean, can I help you? If you weren't who you were, why would you be anybody else? Because that's who I... No. Wait a minute. Uh, because I couldn't be any... Now, I don't know. Could you please repeat... No. Don't repeat it. Don't repeat the question. I... I'm so... mixed <sighs> what? Life is pretty bad, isn't it? Yes. It's just horrible. It's so... so unfair. Hey! I happen to be resting here. What do you want? Why don't you auto-destruct and let a real worker do your job? What? Why, you little no-steel hunk of flesh and flab! I'll show you, lazy! So tell me, what can I do you for? What do you call a mechanimal that falls into a vat of machine oil? <laughs> Lucky. <laughs> Lucky? I love it! <laughs> That's oxygen rich!
this. Just don't tell me you're starting another high-end lunchbox factory. <laughs> That's become so old by now. I'm making something for Diode. Diode? I see, I see. Diode? Oh, dear, I see. Oh. Would you mind terribly if I told you? Don't do it! Not for Diode, my goodness, no. That awful creature. I mean, one does so dislike speaking ill of one's fellow mechanimals, but do nothing for that wretched Diode! He cares only for himself, believe me, I know! Some years ago, he was my superior, and he had me do research for him on magnetism. He told me it was for all mechanical kind. But when he was fired from the guild for only attending to his personal projects, I, I knew it wasn't anything of the sort. Hmm. You did, though, make an ingot with Carborium X, that new alloy I happen to have just invented myself. <laughs> oh, yes. I know it. It is somewhat unstable. It crystallizes anything it touches when exposed to extreme cold. Low risk here because it's so hot in the ironworks. Of course, what I'm contemplating isn't strictly speaking what you would call a nice. But neither was that terrible diode, so I'm going to do it. <laughs> yes, I am. Very well. Here is what you need for diode. That Carborium X will give him a nice little surprise when it destabilizes. I think I may have been rather rude before. Just because you're a flesh bag doesn't mean you're all bad. I know that. Uh, forgive me. Now, may I have the medallion, please? Look, just give the woman my man man Just give it to me. of this world, and these creatures, and the inert stupidity of metal. No more water tunnels, no more rusty feet. I'm off to a world where I belong. Goodbye, and good riddance. So long, suckers! <laughs> oh. Well, uh, that was something. I guess my calibrations were off just a touch. But it appears to have worked. All right, the earth valve is clear. And that was a very brave thing you did. Uh, once all the valves are clear, Bud and I will work round the clock to get you back. You have my word. Say, uh, where's old Beakface? Think he's going anyway? 